Hello guys, I'm back with your favorite show of the entire YouTube. Today I'm gonna try to survive more 15 days and this is what happened. <laughs> so let's go. So on the day 100 I started by looking at our beautiful construction and I start by finally trading a lot because I could trade everything I want and I was totally rich on emeralds and that's pretty amazing. And after that I was trying to fix the farm and some of you on the last video told me on the comments that I could simply make this. Put a slab on the bottom of the block of water and it's done, it's totally fixed. And now I just needed to fix the rails, but because of the aquatic update it's pretty simple to fix them, I could crouch and uh, <laughs> literally being on the rail. But let's sleep first and let's go to the day 101. On this day I started by farming a lot of emeralds because, you know, it's quite easy now to have a lot of emeralds and I wanted more farmers that sell pumpkins, but this one didn't sell so... Fire is a cool thing to villagers, it's so cool to see them die because they are annoying all the times. So we all know that I didn't do nothing, this is the first villager that I'm trying to trade. And of course I farmed a lot of carrots again. So my first villager likes a lot of carrots, he likes a lot of carrots, and now he likes fire, fire! Oh my god, I'm a psychopath. So after that very small incident, this guy found me because when I want him, he doesn't appear and now that I was not expecting him, he appeared. So I decided to trade all uh, some ice because I didn't have and after trading with them, I murdered all of his friends because Minecraft is a game for kids. Yeah, for kids, they say. <laughs> And by the time I was trying to kill and cure more villagers because I wanted more sheep trades. And at the night I was trying to find some spiders because I needed the eye to make more weakness potions. Oh, there is one, nice. Yeah, it's morning again and I got another villager inside my trading hall. And I spent the rest of the day trying to find the villagers with power 5 because I wanted to make a bow and bows are pretty good on hardcore mode. Oh my god, there are so many. <laughs> Well, after complaining about myself because I'm stupid, I decided to finally fix the farm because it was missing one or two observers and oh my god, this is full already, how is it possible? How is it possible it's already night? It's always night on Artcore, I don't understand. So on this day I started by the morning to catch some mushrooms because I need to make the weakness potion. And I traded, like always. You're gonna get a lot of this, I'm sure you're gonna get a lot of this. Yay, the weakness potions, more villager to me. Like I said, more villagers to me. Your trades are shoot, so eat some sand. We are growing too fast, that's why you're gonna be family friendly. So I said shoot instead of she- oh my god, I said anyways. No, no, I just fallen into the villagers, come on, go for- oh my god, no! <sighs> I'm good. What? Uh, uh, free cup in here. Where is the villager? Why is he there? How? Just how? And family friendly. Do you remember? And look at me trying to find the right trade. <laughs> Why am I so disorganized? And I was finally getting a pretty decent amount of good books that I could enchant my tools and my armor and everything that I want. And on the next morning I started to trade with more farmers, trading again. So I have a lot of farmers now and a lot of things to trade, but uh, it's so boring to trade. It's so boring. I was happily jumping and this happened. Why? The zombie just go by no reason to the sun. I was freaking out and uh, I just pick at any block that I want. And look, look at my big brain. I got a bucket of water and I tried to make this. <laughs> the zombie was dying, it was a name tag, but at the end it was alive. It was alive. This game sometimes is so broken and annoying at the same time. How is it possible the zombie for no reason start going? <laughs> it's not possible, guys, it's not possible. But at least this farm was producing a lot of pumpkins, but a lot. And I finally could uh, put another villager into the trading hall, finally. Can you please enter the hall? Can you please go to the trading hall where you're gonna be stuck all of your life? Come on, come on, just stay, oh my god, come on, finally, finally. So it's again morning, trading, and more trading. And it was time to do the zombie to go again to the right place, but it's not easy. Oh, uh, come on, how am I gonna do this? It worked, it's on the right place. Something that goes well, finally a beautiful day. And guess what, trading, and more trading. And guess what, that's mine. And it's night. Ah, uh, day 108, I guess. Where I started by replacing some pumpkins with melons because, you know, stonks move. Yep, yeah, this is too much. I will not spend this in a hole here. I just need more villagers. Now you should go to that part. Wait, what the f- <laughs> What the hell just happened? Why this machine is so broken? You gonna die, yeah. So I spent the rest of the day empty the farm and crying like a man, sweating, you know. 
And on the next day, on the morning of the next day, I started by building the rest of the library because I need a place for the villagers. Believe me, I really need. And on the next days, probably it's all about building and building. Just how? It's already night and I need to sleep. Did you notice that big brain move? I don't know, it's just stupid or big brain, but it was cool. Now it's 110, where I just builded very slowly and carefully. And it's night. It's night again. And I build again, very slowly and carefully. And traded. Oh, what a boring day. And building. At least I'm having fun building, but probably it's kinda sucks for you because it's just looking at me placing blocks. And I needed some wood because now it's tree time. And something different happens. Some pillagers just spawned on my building and I'm really annoying with them and they are annoying with annoying noises. And it's night, mobs are going to spawn. It's all annoying, boring, but beautiful. But it's the next day where I traded. And traded. And builded. And builded even more. And I sleep. And I build. And I decided to upgrade my axe to the max level. I have to admit, I kinda like to build on the night. Look at the moon, it's so beautiful. It's so peaceful, how can I say? This? Yep, I'm still building. And I need more wood. And I'm trading even more. And finally something different, I changed some pumpkins to more melons. And look at this, this is kinda painful to watch me getting smashed by pistons every time that I touch an implant. But I'm back to building. And one great thing that I want to make is all the achievements, I need to kill the Ender Dragon, probably on the next episode I will do it, and there's a lot of boring stuff, but cool stuff too. I'm so proud of myself, oh my god, look at this beauty, just look at this beauty, I'm so proud of myself. What the hell, we are fighting the Nazis, the pillagers, not the, na the pillagers, yes, but I can't find it. <laughs> Did they really spawn it off the top of my building? What a beautiful... <laughs> What the hell is this? <laughs> Perfect, now I can take all of them with my incredible bow. I was like trying to find them like 10 minutes ago and they are on the top of the building. <laughs> this was a big fight, just a huge fight, so I will do it with an happy music for you not to become sad. That was like two days. Two freaking days fighting them. <laughs> but it was fun. So on the next day I I think I needed some slime so I decided to mine some chunks and I found diamonds <laughs> in the middle and close to my nether portal. And yeah I was doing a huge huge excavation and it was the first time I think I was building underground. And I was trying to be organized again. Again, I, I bet you that this will become literally a mess after uh, so one or two days. I will give you three days. Oh yeah, boys, I'm becoming rich. Oh yes, and of course I traded like all days I do this. It's so boring, but I need to because my pumpkin farm is it's really full. Just look at this. Almost one full double chest. Double chest. Oh yes, and I quite clear a little the area around because I wanted to flat things. Of course I will make good and beautiful terraforming, but first I need to get rid of these strange looking mountains. 
Oh yes, and on the next day I tried to build more, but guess what? These guys are back again after two or three days. I'm sick, so I'm so sick of them. I will not kill that guy with the banner because it will provoke a raid again. Haha! -ha. <laughs> I'm so smart. Now you will stay forever there. Uh, probably it will despawn, but uh, the next one I will probably put a name tag, and there is no more pillagers attacking my villagers. Oh yes, and I didn't tell you that my iron farm is broken because they killed the villagers and uh, the villager breeder is broken too. Oh yes, and the days are passing by and I'm still building. And if you notice, two of the walls are flat because there will be another building next to them. So we don't care about the details on that walls. We are almost on the top. I think it's the last pieces. Look at that. It's looking beautiful, but of course it's missing just a little off the top and I need still to make the roof, but I think it's enough of building for this episode. Guess what? This was a lie. <laughs> so I just cleared some more space. I build it. And I build it until night. And it's morning again, and I think I finished this part of the building. And uh, it looks a little tall, I think, but on the next episode it will become better with the other buildings. Oh, and we need to be careful of creepers, because they are bad and they can explode. Did you remember that? It's not great. But I decided to make something that could catch the ship hull by itself, and I'm building a machine. And this is my horse! Yes, finally the skeleton horse has some saddles, because the pillagers dropped some. And uh, I need a name for him, so tell me a name. Come to the machine, ship, 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 ship. It's not a trap, 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 trap. Come to the machine. Who is the happy ship? Who is the happy ship? You are the happy ship. Now we're gonna be stuck for the rest of your life. Grey head, I don't know what is your name now. <laughs> and it's done. It's inside of a box. And it's working! And I decided to mine a little more, so yes, I got more resources and I'm clearing more chunks because I want the slime. Oh my god, the slime spawned! I have a slime chunk! Yes! Yes! Oh my god, finally I have slime, I'm so happy. And it's night and I'm scared that a creeper blow me up when I'm sleeping, I think it's all clear. I can go to the day 1 to 5. Where I started by catching a lot of wood, because I started to make the second floor where it was going to be like a storage place that I needed, but uh, in the future I will transform it into a trading wall. Oh yes, and the interiors are going to be all improvised, <laughs> so probably they will become the ugliest thing that we'll see. No, I'm just kidding, I can do something decent, I guess. I don't know how, but these are freaking flying, and can you see the roof, artistic roof that I've done? I don't know if that looks good, but I don't care, I just need to sleep now. It's not night, how is it possible? Sleep, 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 sleep. <sighs> Very nice. Morning, and uh, I'm just trying to... To fit some glasses, I didn't plan this well because I don't know. I don't think it will look cool. Okay, uh, this looks not bad at all, but not perfect. But it's what I can do by now. On the next day, I started by making a water elevator in the middle of the build because I needed to go up, and I didn't like ladders in this type of build, so I just made or I tried to make. A nice looking water elevator. And nights are dangerous because are entering a lot of zombies. I'm so sh shoot to sing. I think it's ready for the water, I just need soul sand now. Okay, I think it's done, I just need to try it. It's working, I don't know. Uh, okay, we are on top and I think it's working. Now let's go down on this way. Okay. It's working. I think it works. It's perfect. I'm not totally happy with the design. I think it's a little ugly, but uh, now I just want the villagers to go inside and I'm doing this the fast as I can and not as many like beauty and stuff like that. So yeah, I just missing the floor now. I need trading. I need more items. And I'm good and trading again. I think I'm getting the master of the bow. I'm really a master. I kill everything that uh, can be like 50 blocks away, but uh, did you notice on the fight that I kill a Vex like Snowscope 360? <laughs> oh yeah, and it's night and I'm working on the floor. This floor will be the most beautiful thing you ever see. Now it just will be typical texture floor. Okay, the floor is almost done. I just need to fix some missing holes. And it's not looking bad at all. It was a fully improvised interior. And of course I just made the ceiling and the floor and stuff like that. But it's not looking bad, look at this. It's not looking bad at all. 
Okay, then, but I don't like that much of this ceiling. The floor is perfect. I, I really like them. The windows and the ceiling, it's not perfect. I might change it on the future, maybe on the next episode, when I'm doing really, really the interior. Now, it's just missing the villagers inside, and I can finally start cleaning the area around. Okay, wait a minute. What am I doing? How is I supposed to make them go inside? What am I doing? I'm so lost. Okay, this is a total mess and this should go there. Should go. Okay, how I'm gonna put the villagers inside the minecarts? I don't have a single idea. <laughs> oh my god, what have I done? I love the fact that I touch this. This becomes worse. But the villagers getting inside the minecarts finally after one day. One full day. And now I just need to get them on the rails. Okay, okay, perfect. It's working. This is working. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. It's a train. Oh my god, the villager train is going. <laughs> oh my god, they are totally... <sighs> okay, it's working. I will not complain more. It was fun, I have to admit. This was fun to do. And they are inside. Now, it's done. Okay, finally I can clean a little the area around. It's a big mess with a lot of random farms. But at the end this will be a beautiful city, I guess. I want to make a city. But finally I can remove some of these rails. But first I need to take the other villagers to the inside of the building too. How I gonna do it? Um, I have no idea. Okay. Can you please, sir, enter the minecart? Can you please? Okay, this is not a good sign. Come on, enter the minecart. Ah, oh, they are so annoying. I hate working with villagers. They are the most annoying species on the entire story of Minecraft. Okay, I think it's all done. I, I'll ignore that guy, it doesn't matter. Uh, <laughs> ignore it, just uh, it's not a good trade. Now I just need to pass all the items of this chest and organize them inside of the building. And this is not going to be fun. I will spend, uh, I bet, like five days. I think five days. Okay, let me give you an update. Things are getting a lot organized. Look at this. I'm making the best organization ever. And it's kind of beautiful, I guess. Okay, this looks great. I don't know why this chest is beautiful. <laughs> Just forget about that one. Look at this one. <laughs> this is much better. But I'm thinking of making an ender chest. Before that, let me see where is the ender portal. Oh, damn. It's for that direction. Okay. It's an update for the Ender Dragon. But before that, let me craft this Ender Chest. Oh, it looks good. And I'm putting all the diamonds that I've got and all the valuable stuff that I could... I don't say lose because if I die, I lose everything. But look at these diamonds. Let me flex the diamonds. So I cleared a little the area around and I made this achievement because I want to make them all. And I'm finally cleaning this area. And look at Svon, Svon, Svon. Svon, it's its name. So I clean it during an entire day. And I'm still moving all the items and the bad ones are going to burn. Yes, I caught fire on the wood. I'm so smart. <laughs> and I decided to enchant my... Oh, efficiency 4 on my diamond hole. I have a lot because trading villagers, it's so easy now. And I clean an even more area. Of course, that I fixed some places too. And guess what? I'm still cleaning. And that even more back then, it was kind of weird. Back there, it's been 6 hours that I'm editing this video, but I need to finish. Just a small update of red, of grey, I think it's grey now. Oh, it's beautiful, that wheel. And there's one thing that I need to show you now. There's one thing. Look at this. <laughs> I don't have space almost to store that. It's a double chest, it's full. And I still trading every single day. And now, of course, I have melon too, and it's all full. It's all full. I think the last thing I will go to build this episode will be the roads and the paths because yes, I need to make beautiful roads. I don't want them to look that city, if you know what I mean. I want to look more rustic, more I don't know, something like that. And to build that I need to fix a little of the creeper explosions that made these things. Oh my god, these holes are huge. Oh, wait a minute. More slime! More slime, yes, I got more slime, but I will need a lot more. It's all quite organized, so I think I can start to build the paths. I gonna do this tile for the walkway, because it's kinda rustic and destroyed. I think it will be missing a lot of details, but 
We are getting there. It's all the times missing details, am I right? Now I just need to do this to separate the road of the pathway. I think like this it's better, okay. Half of the street it's finished. Basically what I'm doing now is separate the road and uh, tapping some uh, holes because the terrain it's all... I don't know, it's full of uh, water things and holes and stuff like that, but it will become beautiful, amazing, incredible at the end. I was listening a lot of noises, so I decided to find and... Oh boy, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Where did he go? I'm so dead. <laughs> what the hell? Is that Tim? What? Did you saw that? Oh my god, I have Slenderman after me. No, it's there. Come on, it's inside the blocks. Okay, nice. <laughs> What the hell am I gonna die? I for sure gonna die. And because I'm strong, I decided to clear an entire cave. Oh my god, how many creepers? Ah, just two. I already found like four. And this bow is amazing, I'm the best. I'm Chuck Norris of Minecraft. I'm on the surface, it's raining and it's... it's night. I'm on no, no one's land, I need to find my house. Where it is? Yeah, it was morning and I need to kill off these mobs. There were so many mobs burning. Ah, oh, it feels so good to kill them all. Burn, by Burn. So I wanted to kill more because I'm a murderer. Just, oh no, I'm not a murderer. <laughs> I'm not, okay? That should be explicit. I don't want anyone to call me a murderer. <laughs> okay, no, I decided to explore a little this dungeon, this uh, nether thing. And I almost died twice, but uh, it's all clear now. I, I think... Everything, it's now much easier. Okay, come to Papa, come- Oh my god, what is this? Oh my god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Parkour, parkour, wild birding. Oh, I'm alive, what the hell was that? Why I was on fire? Why? Oh, oh my god, it's a blaze. Of course it's a blaze. One shot, kill. Oh, it's it's really dead. I'm the best. I'm the best. Let's go home, I'm sick of this. But before, let me mine some netherite. It's so easy to find it. No, it's not. <laughs> but I find some. Like, what? I was finding so much netherite, literally, on my mind, it was like three together. That's so rare, I have no idea how I could do this. Oh yes, and I decided finally to trade something with these boys. I give them gold, they give me some pretty rubbish stuff. Home, home sweet home finally, ah, it feels so good to go home, fast, 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 finally home. So guys, guess what I am doing, the super stone destroyer is ready. And full upgraded. Look at that. It's insanely good. So after the netherite stuff, I was trying to find some ice because I wanted to make a basalt generator and I need ice to do that. And I was trying to find some with my beautiful, beautiful horse that has no name because it didn't give one until now. Okay, I got some and it's not that far away. And my horse, thank you so much for the trip. It's so much faster to travel by horse, but of course it's not an elytra. It's a horse, it's cool. Okay, okay, I was back to the nether, the scary nether that uh, I'm almost dying every time that I go there. Just to find some basalt or some soil soil because I want soil soil to make the generator if you know what I mean. Finally, I found this biome. Just finally. It was a long trip to here. So I just need to pick some of that soil and maybe some bone blocks. And I'm back at home and now I'm doing the basalt generator. Okay, it's working and it's quite cool. <laughs> now I just need to mine, but my pickaxe is too overpowered, so I'm just digging a lot faster than it grows. But the streets will be made of basalt because it's not that dark, it's like a great texture. And I like it for the coat. And I'm doing the roads. It will, it's beautiful making these roads, the texture of this block. It's so underrated because it looks perfect. It looks really good to roads. This texture is really good. Perfect. It's full done. It's beautiful. Now I'm just adding some more little details that will improve the building. I want to make now like some tall trees in the middle of the street. And uh, on the other side I will make another road. Like a beautiful city. It's like this but it's kind of mess. It's kind of destroyed. I don't know destroyed It's not the right word. But uh, it has a, a lot of textures and now it's just meeting, missing the trees that I will probably start on the next episode because I think it's literally day 50 and on the day 50 it's all the times a showcase. You know it but you have an idea what I'm going to do. So guys it's finally day 150. So 
On this day, you know, I always make a showcase what have I done. In these 50 days, I just... Oh yeah, the ship box, the red, um, grey, I think it's grey now. This, uh, all these farms are kind of broken because the villagers died when I got attacked. I fixed the pumpkin melon farm. Okay, that is for farming wood, it's new, because I want to make trees over there. And at the end, I want to have a view of the beautiful library. So guys, this is how it looks right now. Of course, it this will be huge, okay? Next episode, I want to make the other building. I am thinking of killing the Ender Dragon. Of course, I will start by making these trees, the other road on this side, and it's all coming together. So guys, thank you so much for watching and see you on the next episode because this is real long and bye bye guys, bye!